Production of Exit 13 is made possible in part by a grant from Wood Structures Incorporated of Biddeford and Saco, Maine, providing wood trusses to the Northeast. Hey, now where are we going? Where will we convene? We're gonna go on down the road to Exit 13. We're coming to the city. The skyline can be seen. Look at the lights. Take that next right. It's Exit 13. Tonight on Exit 13, one of New England's most popular performers of Irish music and songs of the sea. Northeast Winds has two albums to their credit and have been performing for audiences across the country since 1978. Keep your eyes well peeled today. Pick size men are on their way. They're looking for the mountain day and the hills of Connemara. Gather, Gather up the pots and the old tin cans and mash the corn, the barley, and the bran. Run like the devil from the excise men. Keep the smoke from rising bar. Well, mountain breezes as they blow, and you hear the echo in the glen below. The excise men they're on the go and the hills of Connemara. The old tin cans of ash, the corn, the barley, and the bran Run like the devil from the excise men Keep the smoke from rising far There's a gallon for the preacher and a quart for Tom There's a pint for a good old father John The doctor's prayers who sings along in the hills of Panama the old tin cans of ash, the corn, the barley, and the bread. Run like the devil from the excise men, keep the smoke from rising far. Well, early up, boys, and don't be late. For the excise men, they're at the gate. Glory be to God, they're drinking it straight in the hills of Connemar. Gather up the pots of the old tin cans of ash, the corn, the barley, and the bread. Run like the devil from the excise men, keep the smoke from rising far. Gather up the pots and the old tin cans and mash the corn, the barley, and the bread. Run like the devil from the excise men, keep the smoke from rising Barney. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Thank you and welcome to Exit 13. And what a pleasure to be here tonight uh, playing for you folks. And before we do the next song, I'd like to take just a half a second and introduce you to the members of Northeast Winds. The wonderful. the wonderful members of Northeast Winds, that's right, I forgot that. Standing over on my far right, way over there, is my partner for over eight years. The fellow plays the guitar, the concertina, and the banjo, the bass, and sounds a lot of the great singing. That's Emery Hutchins. Make Emery welcome tonight. Will you give him a hand? And Next to Emery is the gal who's been with, uh, with us since we started this band eight years ago. She comes originally from the state of Rhode Island, and she's traveled with us all over parts of America and Canada. She plays the bass, the boron, the penny whistle, and sings all the beautiful ballads. That's the lovely Miss Paula McHugh. Make Paula welcome. Give her a hand, will you? And the gentleman who is the newest member of Northeast Winds, he's been with us only for about eight or ten weeks now. He's a, a fiddle player, as you can see, accordion player, melodeon player, fine vocalist, ladies and gentlemen. That's Mr. Taylor Whiteside. Hear it for Taylor. And it falls upon me to introduce our band leader, our spiritual leader, our paymaster, our bus driver, who can occupy all four lanes of the four lane at one time. Mandolin, guitar, and banjo singing, Mr. Alan McHale. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Taylor, would you like to introduce the song? We have a tune here from the Irish province of Kentucky. <laughs> and it's called Ragtime Annie. It goes something like this. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you very much. We're going to do a song for you now that was written by a man named Eric Bogle, written about one of the, the great battles which took place during World War I, that being the Battle of Suvla Bay, a battle in which the Anzac troops from Australia and the British Isles were sent in against the Turks, and both sides were massacred in the thousands. The song tells the tale of one lone Australian trooper who suffered great wounds and grievous loss. The name of the song is The Band Played Waltzing Matilda. When I was a young man, I carried me pack. And I lived the free life of a rover From the Moray's green basin To the dusty outback I waltzed my Matilda all over And in 19 and 50 My country said, son It's time to stop rambling There's work to be done so they gave me a tin hat and gave me a gun And they sent me away to the war And the band played waltzing Matilda As the ship pulled away from the quay And amid all the cheers, flag waving and tears we sailed off for Gallipoli. Tis a well I remember that terrible day when our blood stained the sand and the water, and how in that hell did they call Suvla Bay? We were butchered. Like the lambs at the slaughter. Johnny Turkey he was ready. He primed himself well. He rained us with bullets and showered us with shell. And in five minutes flat, we're all belong to hell. Nearly blew us back home to Australia. And the band played waltzing Matilda As we stopped to bury our slain And we buried ours And the Turks buried theirs And it started all over again Those who were living just tried to survive In that mad world of blood, death and fire And for ten weary weeks I kept myself alive All around me the corpses piled higher Then a big turkey shell Knocked me arse over it And when I awoke In me hospital bed To see what it had done Christ, I wish I were dead Never knew there was worse things than dying For no more I'll go waltzing Matilda all around the green bush, far and near. But a hum tan tin pace, a man needs both legs. No more waltzing, Matilda, for me. They collected the wounded, the 
crippled the maid and shipped us back home to Australia. Some honest, some legless, some blind, some insane. Those proud wounded heroes of Suvla. And when the ship pulled in the Sukiyalaki, I looked at the hole where me legs used to be. And thank Christ, there was no one waiting there for me. To grieve, to mourn, or to pity. And the band played waltzing Matilda As they carried us down the gangway But nobody cheered They just stood there and stared And then turned all their faces away So now Every April I sit on my porch And I watch the parade pass before me I see my old comrades How proudly they march Renewing the deeds of past glory I see the old man All tiles to dance over Forgotten heroes of a forgotten war And the young people ask What the hell are they marching for? And I ask myself the same question And the band plays waltzing Matilda And the old man still answers the call but year after year, the numbers grow fewer. Someday no one will march there at all. Waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda. And their ghosts can be heard as you march round the Billy Bong. Who oh, come a waltzing, Matilda, with me? It's called Roll Alabama Roll. Oh, the Alabama's keel was laid. Roll Alabama Roll. It was laid in the town of Birkenhead. Roll Alabama Roll. It was laid in the town of Birkenhead. Roll Alabama Roll. It was laid in the yard of Jonathan Land. Roll, Alabama, roll. Roll, Alabama, roll. Down the Mersey River she sailed then. Roll, Alabama, roll. She was Liverpool fitted with guns and men. Roll, Alabama, roll. Roll, Alabama, roll. From the Western Isles and she sailed forth. Roll, Alabama, roll. To destroy the commerce of the North Roll, Alabama, roll Roll, Alabama, roll To fight the North, Sam's did employ Roll, Alabama, roll Any man had fit to kill and destroy Roll, Alabama, roll Roll, Alabama, roll 
Into Sherbert Port she sailed one day He rolled Alabama, roll To take her share of the prize money He rolled Alabama, roll Roll Alabama, roll Every sailor that he saw his doom Roll Alabama, roll When the kiss out she hove in the view Roll Alabama, roll Then the ball from the pole would pivot that day. Roll Alabama, roll. Shot the Alabama stern away. Roll Alabama, roll. Roll Alabama, roll. At the three mile limit in 64. Roll Alabama, roll. The Alabama was seen no more. Roll Alabama, roll. Thank you very much. On the map of Ireland, we have four compass points. In the south, we have Bantry Bay. Way to the north, the dockside in Derry, that's called Derry Cay. Over in the west, on the Western Ocean, Galway Bay, and in the east, on the Irish Sea, a beautiful Dublin town. The song is called The Star of the County Down. Near Banbridge Town, in the county down, one morning last July, down a bowling green came a sweet Colleen, and she smiled as she passed me by. She looked so sweet, from her two bare feet to the crown of her nut brown hair. Such a winsome elf. I was ashamed of myself, for to see I was really there. From Bantry Bay down to Derry Cay, and from Galway to Dublin Town. No maid I've seen like the brown colleen that I met in the county town. As she onward sped, sure I cocked my head, and I looked with the feeling red. And I says, says I, to a passerby, who's that maid with the nut brown hair? He smiled at me, and says to me, that's the gem of Ireland's crown. Young Rosie McCann from the banks of the band, she's the star of the county down. From Bantry Bay down to Derry Cay, and from Galway to Dublin Town. No maid I've seen like the brown Colleen that I met in the county down. Sunday clothes with me shoes shine bright and me hat cocked right for a smile from the nut brown rose. No pipe I a smoke, no horse will I yoke till me plow turns a rust covered brown. Till I see shining bright by me own firelight the star of the county down. From Bantry Bay down to Derry Cay, and from Galway to Dublin Town. No maid I've seen like the brown Colleen that I met in the county town. 
From Bantry Bay down to Derry Cay And from Galway to Dublin Town No maid I've seen like the brown collie That I met in the county down and girls get ready here we're going to do a couple of Irish rebel tunes for you that's right our first uh, our first rebel song is a song that, uh, that was written as a call to arms and as you hear the, uh, the chorus and, and the verses you can listen for the, the call to go out through the valleys and, and, and through the dells to arise and cast off the repressor it's called the rising of the moon <laughs> Oh, then tell me, Sean O'Farrell, tell me why you hurry so. Hush my buckle, hush and listen, his cheeks were all aglow. I bear orders from the captain, get you ready quick and soon. For the pikes must be together by the rising of the moon. By the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon. For the pikes must be together. By the rising of the moon And then tell me, Sean O'Farrell Where the gathering is to be In the old spot by the river Right well known to you and me One more word for signal token Whistle up a marching tune With your pike upon your shoulder At the rising of the moon by the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon, with your pike upon your shoulder at the rising of the moon. Out of many a mud walled cabin, eyes were watching through the night, and many a manly heart beat for the coming warden light. Rumors ran along the valley like the banshee's lonely crew. And a thousand pikes were flashing up by the rising of the moon. By the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon. And a thousand pikes were flashing by the rising of the moon. There beside that singing river, that dark mass of men were seen. Far above their shining weapons hung their own beloved green. Death to every foe and traitor, whistle up a marching tune. And hurrah, my boys, for freedom, tis the rising of the moon. By the rising of the moon, by the rising of the moon. And hurrah, my boys, for freedom, tis the rising of the moon.
ladies and gentlemen, that's Emery Hutchins over there playing the guitar. Give Emery a hand for his work tonight. Thank you very much. That's Paula McHugh on the bass. Give Paula a hand. Woo! Taylor Whiteside on the guitar. And Mr. Alan McHale on the mandolin. Production of Exit 13 is made possible in part by a grant from Wood Structures Incorporated of Biddeford and Saco, Maine, providing wood trusses to the Northeast.